This is an easy GMAT problem solving practice question from weighted average and statistics, right? The average weight of a group of 30 friends increases by one kg when the weight of their football coach was added. Okay, 30 friends add the football coach also to the group, then the average weight goes up by one from what it was when we just looked at the average weight for 30 friends. The average weight of the group after including the weight of the football coach is 31. They've even given that number. What is the weight of their football coach is what we have. This is a question which is framed to use the standard framework of averages. Let's get started. There are 30 friends, so write the number 30. One coach all together, it's going to be 31. We have some information. They basically said that the average weight of the group after including the football coach, the average weight is equal to 31. So we can quickly find out the sum of the weight of all 30 friends and the football coach taken together, all 31 people. That's 31 times 31, number times average. 31 times 31 is equal to 961, 31 square. We want essentially the sum, the sum of the weight of the coach is the weight of the coach itself. We'll come to that in a while, right? 30 students, it says that the average weight increases by one when the football coach is added. So this number is if this average is equal to A, 31 is equal to A plus 1, which means A is equal to 30. It is 31 after adding the weight of the football coach. The average went up by 1 when the football coach's weight has also been added to the group. Now, if you remove it, 31 should go down by 1, which means it should become a 30, right? So, essentially, the average weight of 30 friends is equal to a 30. So, some of their weights is 30 times 30, which is equal to 900. Very straightforward. With the coach, the weight is 961 totally. Without the coach, the weight is equal to 900. Therefore, the weight of the coach is essentially 31, sum of all 31 minus sum of 30, which is 961 minus 900. Don't write any of these steps. I am writing it because we are in a learning mode. In the examination, you should say 961 minus 900 is 61. Find out the answer option, mark it and move on. Choice B is the correct answer to this question.